Hello YouTube, uh, welcome back to my channel. Uh, in my unboxing a little while ago, which you must have seen on YouTube by now, I forgot to uh, tell you guys about this Oppo uh, power bank, which I got delivered along with the phone. Now this normally costs you around £25 on Amazon.co.uk, but uh, there is a special deal going on on Amazon.co.uk. If you buy any Oppo phone, which is, whether it's the Find 7 or the R7 or the R5, um, and with selected models, they've got a special um, deal going on where you can get this uh, uh, this Oppo uh, power bank, a rapid charging power bank, of completely free of cost. So when I ordered my phone last night, um, I had to add this to my basket. And then right at the end, when I was about to pay money, uh, they uh, made the special offer valid right at the end. And it was um, the whole price was taken off. And I got this delivered along with the phone, uh, the power bank, Oppo charge for free. So let's have a quick look at this as well. I haven't even opened it yet, so let me open this up and find this out. I, in fact, when I finished my unboxing, I had a quick look around and I said, oh, I completely forgot. So, um, and the unboxing video was far too long anyway, so I thought I'll just do a quick dedicated video on the power bank and show you guys uh, what this is like. I've never used a power bank before as well, so it was nice of Oppo to actually provide this as part of the deal. And uh, this will get to obviously, I'll get to know what power banks are la la like. Always had good phones with good battery life, even though the Oppo R7's battery life is better than uh, many phones in this category, but it's not the biggest, I'm afraid. It's only a 23 20 milliampere battery. So, um, for those people on the go, uh, you will probably appreciate the fact that Oppo is giving a power bank for free. Now, let's have a quick look at the back of the box before we open this up. So, this box has uh, let me focus this. There we go. It has a 6,000 milliampere um, total charge inside, which which it holds, and it has an output of 5 volt, 2 amp standard, and also a rapid output of 5 volt and 3.5 amp. Uh, you don't get to see power banks uh, charging rapidly, but I think uh, Oppo is trying to get every well as the power bank or the adapter to go on rapid charging. Rapid charging is good though, but I'm not too sure how good it is in the long term. Because if you rapid charge your phone every time, I'm afraid the battery after a year will start playing up or it will lose its stamina or power or quality or whatever you call it. So, okay, so now let's open this baby up and have a look and see uh, what do we have inside. My very first ever power bank. So there we go. This is the Oppo's um, rapid charging power bank. Let's take this out if we can. There we go. Okay, so we are provided with this Oppo's... Uh, Rapid charging, uh, obviously manual, whatever you call it. Um, rapid power bank, user guide. Okay, and also we have, what else we got here? Okay, nothing else. So let's get this out. See if we can plug this out. Okay, there we go. So here it comes out. And I tell you what, it's quite heavy, heavy as well, but also smaller in size as well. Uh, let's compare this with the size of the phone. So it's not too big. And you can easily put this in your pocket and take it along with you as long as you obviously charge it first. So let's have a look around and see. So at the bottom, uh, let's have a look if we can get the phone to focus. Um, there we go. It's too close, I think. Uh, I'm still recording with the LG G4, by the way. And at times, I think it struggles to uh, focus. So let's have a look and see if we can get it to focus. There we go. So we have a 6000 milliampere capacity along with the output of a 5 volt 2 ampere on standard and 5 volt 3.5 ampere on rapid charging the model number is v201 plus as you can see and also it should have some sort of a port this that's the port to obviously charge it and i don't know what this is let's have a quick look oh okay this is the micro usb charging cable uh, which is all the way wrapped along uh, the power bank so you can actually put this into your phone so from the way it works i think is you got to charge it first from here and then once you this is your obviously input which is where you put your volt charge to charge it rapidly and then you can take it in your pocket and once you're ready to use to charge your phone you just plug the cable out and you put it on your phone and it'll start charging your phone uh, rapidly so this is very very handy nice uh, i hope uh, that i won't have to use it because normally wherever i work and when i am home i have mostly i have access to um, a plug socket and I can charge it with the adapter but I will see if I can use this as well 
and then I will report back to you guys how this power bank is like. So guys, I quickly wanted to show you along with the phone that it was a special deal going on Amazon UK. Uh, I will provide a link under the video here. So if you guys want to have a look and see if you are interested in buying the Oppo R7, you, you probably will get the power bank which is worth £25 uh, completely free. And I think this deal is up to until 31st of August uh, this year. So um, if you want to make use of that deal, if you buy this phone or any other phone or probably I think selected Oppo phones, you will probably get this power bank as part of the package completely free. So guys, uh, this was a quick look at the Oppo rapid charging power bank along with the phone. And um, once I have done my testing on the phone and the power bank, I will um, keep on posting videos about the performance overall. We'll also keep an eye on the heating side as well. Apparently the Op Octa uh, Core 615 Snapdragon 64 bit is known uh, prone to a bit of heating as well so we will also find that out along with many other tests including speaker tests battery performance gaming performance as you know my style i do dedicated videos i don't do full reviews but eventually at the end i will do a pros and cons video to uh, let you know my thoughts about the phone after owning it for a couple of weeks and then we will jump to a final conclusion so guys if you like my video please give it a thumbs up if you got any questions please feel free to ask me in the comment section i will try my best to answer them asap and please guys subscribe to my channel as it helps and I will see you in the next video.